It's been a privilege and an honor to be part of this. What excites me most is the fact that it positions us to serve our customers and the community well in this area now and for many years into the future. Um, you know, Oakland has a lot of uh, universities and research uh, facilities and hospitals, uh, vibrant day and night life, and the growth that's happening here is fantastic for our region, fantastic for Oakland, and a substation like this will provide the resiliency that's required for continued growth. We really wanted to present a station that the neighbors would, uh, would appreciate and allow the community to vote. Uh, for the design that they like the best and uh, that's how we ended up with this design for motion concept uh, where there's some fins that are attached to the building uh, that give the uh, appearance of the building actually moving uh, as you pass by the facility. You know the first thing that came to mind for me when I saw this building was really a sense of pride and what the team accomplished. I'm proud to have my name on the facility. In 2015, they proposed a lot of upcoming projects that would put a high demand on the existing electrical infrastructure. It became evident that we would need to build a new substation soon. Uh, it's about less than half the size of a typical urban bulk substation that Duquesne Light would build. So we had to use special equipment to make it happen in this small piece of ground. This community is thriving, it's growing, and uh, substations like this uh, really help us uh, live up to that safe, reliable, affordable, and resilient power. <laughs>